Hey guys, welcome back to another video. If you haven't already, please consider subscribing to our channel. It would help us out a lot. So we are making about a five and a half hour trip from Twin Oaks Campground in Schwahari, New York to HTR Campground in Grand Isle, New York, which is about 15 minutes from Niagara Falls State Park. We got into our campground last night at about 5.30. We're staying at HTR Niagara on Grand Island in New York. And today we're heading over to Fort Niagara. Yeah. A big person slept on there. <laughs> Just kidding. Last time I'll ever sit on this. So, Elliot, why the windows? I want to sit on the table. Right. So, you can put your rifle through here, and you can aim like this, all the way there to there. But for them to shoot you, they have to go through the small hole. Like the big one. <laughs> it's either all like that. Yeah. Okay, come check this out. We're coming. Oh, watch out for this step. Good job, Ricky. 
Oh. No. Oh. Those are the birds that made a nest at our house. Squirrel. Are you talking about the far one? Oh, the far one. Oh, that's a big one. There's chipmunks. His yeah. cheeks are full. <laughs> He's running away. The squirrel's like, you gotta do that. I don't really want to think. Imagine a whole line of us, not just three of us, walking towards you slowly with these bayonets. Detail. Oh, what are you gonna do? <laughs> what are you gonna do? Run. Run. <laughs> You're gonna run because that is the smartest thing to do. Shoulder your arms. <laughs> Good job. Is this where they serve the gunpowder? Yeah. Whoa, cool. They said there was a thing. I like the smell of it, so it's a nice. I wish this was big. Yeah, look how big it is from the outside. Do it on three. One, two, three. Yeah. <laughs> Go back inside. <laughs> it worked. the best you want to count in detail? That's all that's in the camera. In my company, Plan de la Marine, the French colonial infantry. He was responsible for defending the fort against attack, negotiating with Native Americans, supervising the fur trade, and maintaining the condition of the fortress and its garrison. At Niagara, he also had to oversee the condition of the portage road around. Hi.
Welcome to the upper guard room, the Gare du Corps. The French soldiers who lived here in the early 1750s were part of the independent companies of the Navy, Les Compagnies Flash de la Marine. The fort's small guard room. Yeah? Do you see how they make the steps? No. The, they're actually just this thick. It's not like a board and a board. Uh, oh, really? It's that thick, every board. So it's just a big log. Yeah, if you look it up, I was like, oh, the cracks go on. It's just one board. Huh. It's not even close. Nice. Knock it. Hello? You can see it's worn out. Yeah. Part noise. Mm -hmm. You can't see the threads. This is cool. Where are you see these hinges? Yeah, this giant hinges. It's all rolled. So, so this whole thing, if you pick it up, it will come off. Weird nests, bees. Oh yeah. Could be birds. Well, I wonder if it's like the barn swallows, like we had at our house. You can see the babies inside that one peeking out. I saw the babies inside the other one. They're so cute. Hello, mom. Hello, mom. There's a bird flying in and out. Oh. oh, here she comes. She doesn't want to come in because we're in here. What was this? Watch your head. Oh, you're feeding those ones over there? Who's the mama to the other ones? Look at all these birds flying in and out. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's almost two o'clock. What time is it? 1.53. Where is it? Hi. Hi. I feel it tingling. Huh? Bad. This is bad? Yeah. Like oh. the, this is the stuff I like me feeling. <laughs> atmosphere. <laughs> Not having rain. Yeah. That thing used to pump air into the fire, right? Yeah. You bellow? Super smart guys. You see, they just pick up that, they pull the handle. Yeah. And they let it go down. Yeah. Just. Yours is long, so it's... Ellie's is, too. So is yours. <laughs> Stay next to the flight course. Yeah. Hey, you just gotta get under there, you'll be fine.
Don't slip. Oh, there you go. Bust your elbow. There's a lot that, um, that goes into this flag. There's quite a bit written down on the placard there in front of the, uh, the flag you can read. Um, maybe just a couple things about the history of it. So you just saw a movie, a lot of you. And at the end of the movie, you might have noticed that the United States lost the Battle of Fort Niagara, that early morning winter battle. The British won that. And when you win the battle, you get this. So for 150 years, this was in the ancestral castle over in uh, Maganich, Scotland of Gordon Drummond. He was the commander that morning in the Battle of Niagara in December of 1813. It was in his trophy case. Our curator apparently has a black and white photo from the 50s of the thing flying at the castle. <laughs> so we didn't know this was really happening until we got a lucky break and at first it doesn't seem lucky at all. There was a fire in that castle in 1969, okay, almost 60 years ago now. And fortunately when there's a fire, the journalists usually show up in town and they write a newspaper article. And that's how we figured out that the flag was here. Not right away, it took 15 years before, talk about an irony, our enemy in the War of 1812, Fort George, their research staff across the Niagara River found that little Scottish newspaper article about our flag. So, you know, we're kind of overjoyed. We found the original flag. We called up the family. The only person left alive that was connected to the general was the great, great niece. And she said, in no uncertain terms, no. <laughs> this is our family heirloom. She was really unequivocal here. So we thought it was kind of over in 1984. And I don't like to wish bad finances on anybody, but 10 years later, the family needed a new roof on the castle and they didn't have the dough. So that opened them up to negotiate. $150,000 later, we had the artifact, they had the roof. I'm interviewing you. Interviewing? Oh, I'm a star. Did you have fun? Yes. Uh, yes. yes. What was your favorite thing? My favorite thing was probably the musket demonstration. Cool. Me too, probably. Or the, the castle. Yeah, yeah the, the castle, castle was cool. Yeah, that was pretty cool. I want a kitchen like the castle. Ricky. I want a house like the castle. What do you think was the coolest? The uh, castle. <laughs> the castle is the big giant building, right? Yes. Now into Marshmallow. Back to the campsite. Well, I'm around the side. Oh, that's a deep puddle. I don't want to jump. Jump the cavern, Ricky. I'll catch you. I will catch you. <laughs> All right, we're back at our campsite now. We just got back from Fort Niagara. That was really cool to see how the soldiers lived and um, to learn about how many times it changed hands. The storm did go through. You can see our campsite is a little flooded. With water. Smoking a chicken right now. That should be good. But it looks like another storm is going to be making its way.
Are you thinking? Yep. Hmm. Well, you need to breathe. <laughs> yeah. Well, I guess that's put the smoke flavor on. Now it's going to cook it. Is that in my face? Yes. We're playing camping cards. Cribbage. I'm blue. It's the number one for you right there. Mm. Let's play some cards. <laughs> she cheats. I hope I still win. You will. I'm here Mr. Consistency. I'm winning at life. Oh, so sweet. We're tied up. I know. <laughs> All right, I guess I gotta deal this stuff. <laughs> What's he I'm gonna play? Either way. Twenty. Twenty-five. Twenty-five. Thirty. For win! Yay! So I was either gonna make it. I knew you had a five, or I had an ace. Was gonna make it twenty-one. I didn't have an ace. Oh, no, I thought you put a 10. Oh, oh I only have three. Good job. DG. Good game. Come on, blue sky. Come this way. Like I said, the, 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 the small. Oh, Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for the next video where we take a boat ride down the Erie Canal.